monkey mind is not bad, not good. The important is the relationship between you and monkey mind. So if you treat monkey mind as your boss or enemy, then the problem. Monkey mind is restless, crazy. You don't want to have crazy boss. Or if you try to fight with the monkey mind, then monkey mind become your enemy. Then you have enemy always there in your mind. But if you make friends with the monkey mind, and actually monkey mind is quite good. Monkey mind is useful. Then eventually monkey mind transform into wisdom, love, compassion, awareness. So, therefore, the relationship with the monkey mind is really important. So, the one of the important thing is to really make friends with the monkey mind. You have to get, you have to know, get to know each other. Well, that's very important. So now I will tell you a little bit about how monkey mind making the problem. Okay. So one day you went to bathroom and look at the mirror and suddenly you see something in your face. Maybe wrinkles, new wrinkles, or the wrinkle, the old wrinkle already there, but you haven't recognized before. Or you see something, maybe your right cheekbone is a little bit bigger than left cheekbone or crooked, your nose, pinpole, something. So then your the monkey might say, oh dear, you know, something, some problem in my face, the cheekbone. Then you are a little bit worried. And after finish the, you know, using uh, bathroom, you come back and you might have breakfast. And while you're having breakfast, you're thinking about cheekbone again. Oh, cheekbone, yes. What happened is in the brain, there's neurons, what I call gossipy neurons. They love gossip and they're talking each other. Oh, cheekbone is ugly, ugly face, ugly face. And then more and more neurons, they join together and become group. And the group is become bigger, bigger. So how to work with monkey mind, right? So the key point is if you try to fight, it doesn't work. If you listen and believe I'm ugly, yes, I have cheek, cheekbone is terrible, it doesn't work. So what you have to do is for the meditation practice is we need to free monkey mind with a very skillful way. So what is the skillful? Make friends with the monkey mind. And how to make friends with the monkey mind? Giving banana <laughs> doesn't work. So you need to give job to monkey mind. If you can give job to monkey mind, then you become boss. Monkey mind become your employee. And the job is all these different meditation techniques. And slowly, slowly, your mind become more calm, peaceful, not only calm and peaceful, pliable, walkable. So now, monkey mind become more better, nice, wiser, kind. So then monkey mind become benefit for you. So the matter is the relationship between you and monkey mind. That is the matter. But the monkey mind is not bad, not good.